Have you got your eye on a property to do up that requires some major TLC? In this little video, I will point out a few things that you should look out for when taking on a renovation project. Firstly, finances. Is the property mortgageable? Uh, depending on the state of the property, especially if it has no bathrooms or kitchens, it would be uninhabitable and hence uh, not mortgageable. So you might have to consider things like bridging loans, um, cash, or even perhaps a joint venture with a, uh, another investor in order to pool the funds. Also, um, you would have to do budget obviously for the renovation itself, and it's a good idea to keep a contingency fund because uh, dual uppers tend to be a little uh, black hole of expenses. So make sure that you have enough funds to finish your project. Secondly, when you're buying such properties, you have to think of the kind of survey that you'd like to do. Uh, a regular home buyer survey may not be sufficient. Uh, you may have to look into a building survey so that you can get better information on the structure of the building. Um, it's better not to try to skimp at this stage uh, because a survey will be able to point out things that perhaps will save you money in the long run. Then the next thing that you probably have to do is um, to look at whether you want to extend the property. What permissions are there? Is it being sold with planning permission or can you extend um, the property under permitted development rights? So it's important to check the property and what has already been extended, perhaps look at other properties on the street of what possible extensions are uh, being done. Uh, perhaps also speak to the local planning uh, authority, the local planning officers of the local council to give you a better indication of what would be possible with the property. And then finally, once you've got the property, perhaps even before you exchange and complete, you should uh, build around yourself a good team of reliable tradesmen. Perhaps a contractor will be project managing for you, so please um, interview a few different contractors, get some quotes. Perhaps you want to project manage yourself. Either way, you have to have trusted people around you, um, ask lots of questions, make sure they follow your plan, uh, make sure materials are you know, also costed uh, properly so you don't find um, hidden um, costs later on. And you just want a good finish um, in order to maximize your return later should you decide to rent out or sell. The best thing is to try to avoid um, any problems with the renovations. So if you are looking for a dual upper property to buy, um, speak to us at Balfour Stoke. We may just have such a property for sale. Thank you.